U.S. Air Force Chief of Staff confirms F-47 next-generation fighter jet first flight in 2028. According to information published by the Defense Index X account on November 12, 2025, U.S. Air Force Chief of Staff Jen David Alvin confirmed that the F-47, Boeing's next-generation air dominance fighter, will take its first flight in 2028. The aircraft, part of the NGAD program, is expected to replace the F-22 Raptor and redefine U.S. air superiority. Speaking at a briefing and relayed by Defense Index X account on November 12, 2025, Jen David Alvin confirmed that the Air Force's F-47 fighter jet, developed under the Next Generation Air Dominance Program, is on track for its inaugural flight in 2028. The F-47, designed by Boeing, represents a pivotal step in maintaining U.S. air dominance as legacy F-22 Raptors near the end of their operational lifespan. While details remain classified, the announcement signals steady progress on one of the most secretive defense programs in recent history. Artist rendering of the Boeing F-47, the U.S. Air Force's future sixth-generation air dominance fighter, expected to fly in 2028. The image is illustrative and does not depict the final design. Picture source, Defense Index X account. The F-47 is not merely a successor to the F-22. It represents a major evolution in air combat design aimed at redefining the concept of air dominance. Developed to operate in highly contested environments, the aircraft integrates advanced stealth geometry, sensor fusion, adaptive propulsion, and manned-unmanned teaming. It is the central element of the NGAD family of systems designed to function as a networked force multiplier. With its expected top speed of Mach 2, a combat range exceeding 1,800 kilometers, and the ability to seamlessly operate alongside AI-driven drone wingmen, the F-47 offers capabilities far beyond those of current fifth-generation fighters. It is tailored to maintain U.S. air superiority in high-threat regions, particularly in the Indo-Pacific, where long-range operations and survivability against advanced air defense systems are critical. By acquiring 185 F-47s, the USAF aims to field a force capable of rapid adaptive dominance in future large-scale combat operations. This announcement marks the most explicit public reference to the F-47's flight timeline, which has been closely guarded until now. The fighter is expected to incorporate sixth-generation technologies, including manned, unmanned teaming, stealth enhancements, and advanced propulsion systems that reportedly enable speeds of Mach 2 and a combat range exceeding 1,800 kilometers. The USAF intends to procure 185 of these next-generation aircraft to anchor its tactical air fleet beyond 2030, a clear signal that the service is preparing for sustained pure conflict readiness in the Indo-Pacific and other high-threat theaters. Though Boeing has yet to comment officially, multiple defense sources with direct knowledge of the program suggest that initial low-rate production has already begun at Boeing's Phantom Works facility in St. Louis under tight security. This site, already instrumental in the development of the X-45 UC CAV and MQ-25 Stingray, is being further upgraded to accommodate the classified airframe's digital manufacturing needs. An industry official familiar with the matter told Army Recognition on background that major fuselage components are already being fabricated and that at least two airframes will enter ground testing by mid-2027. The F-47's strategic importance lies in its design philosophy it will not operate alone. The aircraft is the central node in the Air Force's envisioned system of systems, operating alongside a fleet of AI-enabled Collaborative Combat Aircraft, CCA, autonomous drones designed to scout, jam, and even strike independently or in concert with the crewed fighter. This concept aligns with emerging U.S. doctrine, which views air dominance as a distributed, networked, and survivable capability rather than a platform-centric fight. Sources close to Air Combat Command describe the F-47 as a combat quarterback directing and synchronizing unmanned wingmen in contested environments. According to Defense Index, Jen Alvin confirmed the timeline during a closed briefing, reinforcing growing confidence in the maturity of the NGAD program. 
While the cost per airframe remains undisclosed, defense analysts estimate that the full F-47 and CCA ecosystem could push the total program cost well beyond current levels for fifth-generation fighters. Nevertheless, the Pentagon appears to be determined to push ahead, positioning the F-47 as a vital capability to counter Chinese and Russian advances in air power over the coming decades. For Boeing, the F-47 marks a strategic return to the tactical fighter domain after more than two decades of Lockheed Martin's dominance through the F-35. Industry analysts see Boeing's role in the NGAD as a potential pivot point for the company's defense business, signaling a deeper commitment to sixth-generation capabilities and digital design. The aircraft's development is also expected to drive investment across the defense industrial base, from high-temperature composites and propulsion technologies to artificial intelligence and mission systems. The decision to proceed with the F-47 signals a shift away from incremental upgrades to legacy platforms. Unlike the F-15EX or even advanced variants of the F-35, the F-47 is built for tomorrow's battle space, one characterized by GPS denial, advanced integrated air defense systems, and electronic warfare saturation. It will incorporate next-generation stealth, multi-spectral sensors, adaptive engines, and modular open systems architecture that allows rapid upgrade cycles in response to emerging threats. Setting the first flight for 2028 puts the F-47 ahead of public expectations and reinforces the urgency of the NGAD timeline. According to Defense Index, testing and integration of its AI-enabled drone teammates will accelerate through 2026 and 2027. Meanwhile, digital twin technology and mission simulation systems at facilities in Palmdale and Edwards Air Force Base are reportedly enabling faster prototyping and systems integration before physical flight testing begins. For Army recognition readers, the F-47's emergence is more than a new airframe. It marks a generational leap in how the United States prepares for high-end conflict. The combination of extended range, hypersonic-level performance, and AI-enabled teaming ensures that the U.S. Air Force will not only maintain air superiority, but redefine it.